Introducing the Access Task Management Template brought to you by AccessLearningZone.com. My name is Richard Rost. This template has all your basic task management features, plus you can organize your tasks into hierarchical lists. You can set up recurring tasks, quickly move tasks between lists, assign tasks to customers, and set up unlimited categories including interests, locations, employees tasks are assigned to, or whatever you like. This template is built 100% in Access with no add-ins, DLLs, or third-party components to install. Plus, you can download a free version to try from my website. The Task Manager creates all the standard fields that you'll find in any task management database. The date that the task was created, a description, an importance, high, medium, or low, an optional due date, and a big notes field. The one feature that sets my Task Manager apart from others is that it has a hierarchical list structure so you can have lists within sublists. This way you can easily separate tasks for any situation. One list for phone calls, sublists to separate work from personal calls, add as many sublists as you want. Think of these like files and folders in Windows. The lists represent folders and the tasks themselves files. You can click on any of the column headers to sort by any field, ascending or descending. You can search based on any keywords found in either the description or the notes field. And you can filter based on various due dates, past due, up to now, up to the end of today, that's handy, tomorrow, within seven days, 30 days, all due dates or no due dates. Show me all the tasks that I haven't assigned a due date to. Up to the end of today is my favorite one. It lets me see all the tasks that were due up to today, maybe something that I've missed and stuff that I have to do later today, but not too much stuff. You can make tasks recurring. So when you mark it completed, it creates a copy of the task at the future interval you specify. This way you have a complete history of all the past times you completed this task. You can also make custom notes on each of them so you have a history of all your completed tasks. If you're like me, you spend at least a little time each day going over your task lists for the day and realizing which ones you're not probably going to get to today. I do this a lot. So I've included buttons that will allow you to quickly run down your task list and move them ahead one hour, three hours, one day, two days, three days a week, and so on. So you can say, okay, this one I'll get to tomorrow, this one I'll get to next week, this one I'll get to in a couple hours. I've also included my world-famous date and time picker pop-ups that are a whole lot more sophisticated than the built-in access date picker. Now this database was built on my tech help template, so you get the full customer database as well. You can assign customers to tasks, filter based on the specific customer, and bring up a list of just that customer's tasks. And of course, you get all the contact management, order entry, and invoicing stuff from the Tech Help database as well. You can assign tasks to one or more categories. Categories are kind of a catch all for any other kind of information that you want to be able to assign to tasks. For example, here you can see I've got employees, interests, and locations. What location is this task set in? What employee or employees are assigned to this task? What are the interests that are associated with this task? Star Wars or Star Trek, for example. You can assign an unlimited number of categories to each task. Then you can filter based on that category. So for example, you can say, show me all the tasks that are assigned to Joe or all the ones that are set in Buffalo, New York. And when you put together the lists with the categories, you can see that the possibilities are endless. Let's say you've got a category set up for each of your product lines. You can say, show me all of the work phone calls I have to make for the XYZ product line by this date. Like I said, the possibilities are endless. If you want to learn more about this database, I've got a feature walkthrough. It's about a half an hour long, but I walk you through setting up the database, adding data to it, using all the different features that are in there. Come and watch it. It's on my website. It's absolutely free. Plus, you can download a free copy of the database to play with yourself. See if you like it. And if you have any questions, of course, feel free to contact me or post them down below in the comments section. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.